The uh, classic introduction to turtle graphics consists of making a square. So to make a square, we move some number of steps and then we turn 90 degrees. We want to start out pointing in 90 degrees and then if we just do this four times, we'll have a square. That becomes easier to see if we put the pin down. One, two, three, four. We can also do this in one step just by saying something like repeat four times, make a square. Like this. And of course, uh, the classic, uh, I'm going to hide the primitives and make a block and just call it square. Now we can take our tested code, drop it in here, and now whenever we say square, we go to square. Of course, we might want to have an input to make squares of different size, sizes. So I'll make an input called size, and then I'll say move that number of steps, and at this point I can make a square of any size, like, like uh, 75 turtle steps. There we go. If I wanted to make it a little bit clearer what this input was, I could add some title text that just says size, and this would allow me to say square 75 steps, and that, that tells me what the size is. There are some other things I can do. Uh, click here, and if I want, I can just have a little square icon, and then when I say OK, it has an icon of a square there. I'm going to edit that back out and just leave it at that. But you can also, if you like, make size into a drop down menu. We do that by clicking on it and going over to the extended menu. And then we'll say we want this to be read only, only the options that we provide in the drop down menu. And then we can select our, our options. I'm going to have a small, medium, and large square. Small, medium, and large. Say medium. And if I do that, I get small, medium, or large as options. Now, and when I first drag it over, the default is medium. We start out there. Of course, I have to edit this uh, in order for it to and add some code so that we it understands what I want to happen. So I can say something like, if the size is small, if the size is small, then let's make a size, set size to 25. And in the same way, I can just duplicate this. Now let's see if I can duplicate the entire block. And I'll do that one more time. Duplicate. And so if size equals small, make it 25. Uh, make the size 25. If it's medium, make it 50. And then if it's large, we'll make it 100. So now, when I say OK here and clear the screen, medium is going to be that size, large will be this size, and small will be that size. So I can make a drop-down menu with a square of a small size, or a medium size, or a large size.